I've covered dozens of robotic vacuum cleaners on this channel, and while most of them claim to be totally hands-free, the truth is that pretty much every day you have to, at the very least, empty the wastewater and refill the clean water, even on the fancier, more expensive models. In this video, I'm gonna be partnering with 3i to take a look at the all new S10 Ultra, which is the world's first robotic vacuum cleaner with a water recycle system. So this actually can recycle the dirty water. It can even collect water from the air around it so that you never have to worry about dumping wastewater. And this doesn't require any drainage hoses or water tubes to be connected to this either. All you need is a standard power outlet. This should be pretty interesting. Let's go ahead and get started. The number one feature of the S10 Ultra has to be the water recycle system. This uses a sub-boiling distillation process which heats the wastewater, turning the liquid into steam. It then condenses that steam into reusable clean water while the waste is left behind and eventually sucked into the dustbin. Of course, I had to test this out for myself. I sent the vacuum to clean up a big spill of soda. Once the soda was cleaned up, you can see here that it is left behind in the sewage tank. After that, I sent the vacuum cleaner back to the base station to begin the distillation process. And after about an hour to an hour and a half, you can definitely see the difference in the water level as it recycles the water. Now this water, is fresh and clean. I don't see any of the soda particles or anything like that in this water. It's totally clear. Now, technically the water is distilled. It looks drinkable. I personally would not drink it, but that's how clean this water turned out. Like I've already mentioned, you don't have to have any kind of drainage hoses or water hoses connected to this. You don't have to manually refill the water. This can refill itself just by taking the moisture out of the air. So it also kind of acts as a dehumidifier. 3i claims that if the humidity level in your home is 60% or greater, it only takes about 10 hours to totally refill the tank or to almost refill the tank. Now, I definitely tested this out for myself. I started at about 7 p.m. and then let this collect moisture throughout the entire night. So I spent about 12 hours, so from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. collecting moisture from the air. And as you can see here, I got a decent amount of water. Now where I live, the humidity outside is usually in the 90s, but in my home, the humidity is 50% or less. So if you live in a higher humidity region or if you have more humidity in your home, this will definitely collect moisture from the air much faster than it did in my situation. But still, the fact that it's able to top off the water every single day and you don't have to refill the water definitely makes this a totally hands-free experience. When it comes to the actual performance of the S10 Ultra, this is definitely one of the top vacuum slash mops that I've ever used. This features an advanced dirt scan cleaning strategy technology, which uses both green light and an AI algorithm allowing this to automatically detect and adapt to different types of debris. When this runs into a dry mess, it does slow down the vacuum cleaner and boost the suction power all the way to 13,000 pascal. One thing that I really like about this is once it's finished cleaning up that heavy mess, it then goes back and forth. With this, it ensures that all the dust and all the debris is collected into the dustbin and that you don't have leakage during the rest of the clean. When this detects a liquid mess, it slows down, turns off the vacuum motor, that way it's not sucking up liquid into the dustbin, and then it mops over the mess several times to ensure that it has been fully cleaned up. The S10 Ultra features a self-cleaning roller mop with a 12 nozzle spray system and a scraper to ensure that the roller mop stays spotless and residue free throughout your entire cleaning. Other robotic mops on the market have to rely on returning back to the base station to clean themselves. This is able to clean itself instantly ensuring that you don't have any cross-contamination. The Ultra Reach Roller Mop also ensures that no corner or edge is left untouched, where most vacuum cleaners on the market miss the edges and corners because they just can't reach them. The Ultra Reach Roller Mop actually extends to make sure it goes all the way to the edges. When this goes from your hard floors over to your carpets, it does automatically lift the roller mop up to eight millimeters to avoid cross-contamination or staining your carpets. One of the most impressive parts of the S10 Ultra, in my opinion, is definitely the suction power. So whether this was on hard floors or carpet, it was able to get all the debris that I threw at it, put some coffee beans on my tile floor. It had no issues with that. I made a really big mess with both cereal and coffee beans and some other things and it very easily picked that up. 
And then the most impressive part was I put a couple handfuls of coffee beans on my area rug and this had zero issues picking up every single coffee bean, which is not something that most vacuum cleaners on the market are capable of. The suction power on this was so strong that it actually reminded me more of an upright vacuum cleaner. This has both anti-tangle side brushes and an anti-tangle center brush. The side brushes are designed in a way to deflect the hair straight to the center brush. And then the center brush is equipped with two separate combs that are able to actively detangle the roller brush. I tested this out on some pretty thick dog hair. Once it sucked up the hair, I let it run for a few more minutes. Then it returned back to the base station where it completed its hair removal process. And then when I flipped this over, all the hair had been removed. The Apex Vision technology enables triple obstacle avoidance. And you can tell this definitely does a great job of avoiding obstacles, not just shoes, socks, and other clothes, but also smaller objects like charge cables were no issue for the obstacle avoidance on this vacuum cleaner. And the fact that this is able to get a 3D map also ensured that it wasn't banging into furniture and walls and things like that. It did a great job of avoiding furniture and other obstacles as well. Of course, this has one of the smartest base stations that I've ever seen with both the water recycling system and the dehumidifier system that replenishes the water from the air. This also has a dust bag that can collect dust for up to 60 days, so you truly get a 60-day hands-free experience. The built-in silver ion module purifies the water and prevents bacterial growth. The system also automatically dries the mop when the cleaning's finished. The seven-stage sterilization system ensures that 99.9% of bacteria and germs are eradicated. The S10 Ultra comes with a fully featured application. You can fully control this from your phone or even with your voice through a smart assistant. Within the application, you can set this to clean with AI or you can set this to custom clean this if you need it to just mop or just vacuum. You can tell it how many times you want it to go out. You can even do schedule cleaning right there within the application. If you're looking for a super thorough and efficiently cleaning robotic mop and vacuum that is truly hands-free without having to hire a plumber to install hoses or extra wires, then the 3i S10 Ultra is definitely a great option. I'll be sure to leave a link in the description of where you can find out more information about the 3i S10 Ultra, where you can pick one up for yourself. That about wraps it up for this video. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.